Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Light Forensics. And we're here to look into how different colour lights combine and make different colours. And we're going to look at three different types of light. So we've got green light, we've got red light, and we've got blue light. And people who are familiar with televisions, computer monitors and cell phone displays will recognise these three colours as the primary colours that are used to make the light that you look at. And we're going to combine these different colours and see how they react. And these are just standard water bottles, different colours, and they're filled with water. So that's our filter for filtering the light. As you can see, the green bottle produces green light, the red bottle produces red light, and the blue bottle produces blue light. So, let's combine the light from the red and the blue. So you can see that we get a nice purple colour coming off red and blue combined. So, let's do the same with the green and blue. And you can see that we get a nice darker green coming off, it's probably more of a jade that we're looking at compared to the standard green and the standard blue. So it's a very pretty colour. And if we switch out the blue for the red, we combine the red with the green and we get a nice orange colour. So the question arises as to how these colours combine when all three are mixed together. So let's see what happens. So we have all three colours mixed together and this is the light that it produces. So we get what looks like white light. So that's mixing of three primary colours to produce something that resembles white light. I hope you enjoyed the presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.